All right, guys. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about Metal Flat and why it is the best staller in Metal Fight. So first of all, what a staller is, also known as a tornado staller, is a Beyblade. That's whole goal is essentially mobile stamina. So it just rides the tornado ridge and circles around the Beyblade until they sleep out. So yeah, so Metal Flat is one of the best tips for stalling or the best tip for stalling because it has some properties about it. So the first one is... Um, it is significantly taller than every other tip. Metal flat is one of the more tall tips in the tall category. But what this means is that you can use it with lower tracks without scraping. Uh, this can also be used in standard on BD-145, um, which if you use any of these uh, tips on BD-145, it will scrape, where metal flat will not. Um, a misconception that there is about metal flat is that since it's metal, there's actually less friction. That's not true. Metal flat actually has better friction than these plastic tips, um, meaning it can take hits a little bit better and it also uh, grips the ridge better. And thanks to its shape, it uh, grabs the ridge a lot better than uh, everything else. So we have flat, which is pretty basic. Uh, you, <laughs> you basically use it if you have literally nothing else. Then you have circle flat. Now circle flat is essentially just wide flat. So I'll talk about both these at the same time. So circle flat and wide flat, some people use uh, circle flat has better LED, the best LED out of all of these tips, which is why it's used on some gravity combos. But um, one of the issues with circle flat is it's hard to flower and then it, can all, it has an issue where it can self KO as well. And as you can see, wide flat also has these little notches Metal flat doesn't have that, but that actually can hurt the stall. But uh, this technically has a little bit more LED than metal flat, but and it's faster. But guys, faster doesn't always mean better. Um, metal flat's gonna have more stamina than this, and it's gonna be able to take a hit better. So just launch better, I guess. Um, but yeah, that's wide flat. Then you have whole flat. Now a lot of people do actually like whole flat. Cake used it in one of his uh, tournaments recently. The issue with whole flat is, as you can see on this one, since the plastic is so thin, they get damaged pretty quickly. And to have a good stall with whole flat, you really need a good conditioned one. So they wear really fast. But uh, as you can see, the tip is very smooth like metal flat. So it works pretty good. But metal flat overall is just the best. You can flower it, you can stall it. It has the best stamina. Like I said, this also has more friction I don't care what anybody else tells you. Um, metal has more friction with the stadium than the plastic tips. That's just, it's just how it is. So yeah, I generally use metal flat on Bakushin, as you guys might know me if you've watched my channel. Um, this combo is super good. Um, this is a tornado stellar, but it also has really good defense. So it can tank hits from attack types and then also outstall defense types. So right now I will give a quick demonstration of it actually outstalling something. All right, guys. So this isn't a very good stall, but we have Bakushin Leon RSF in the middle versus Bakushin on Metal Flat. And as you can see, it's doing its job outstalling it. Um, before even making contact, it's gonna sleep it out and the match is gonna be over. And that's how it will generally go with anything using a uh, full rubber tip. Um, so to wrap it all up, Metal Flat is just the best staller. It has the best stamina out of any of them. It has the best uh, KO resistance out of any of them. And then most of all, it has the best controllability out of all of them. So it moves a little bit slower, but it's also a lot more controllable and has better recoil management. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys.